Hi, I'm Vicky of Hit The Books and this is your Zero Tip of the Week. When you receive a refund for something, you need to code it to the same chart of account code you used initially. So if we have a look at this example here, we spent $250 at Placemakers for some repairs and maintenance. And then we returned the goods because they were faulty, so we received a cash refund. So the initial transaction, because it was repairs and maintenance, is going to be coded to the repairs and maintenance code. And by the same logic, we're going to code the refund to repairs and maintenance. which basically cancels out the initial purchase. 